now uh, going to our front end in the view i am going to create uh, three uh, jsp files and uh, one is uh, the home page so i am just creating it as home and uh, another one i am going to create is uh, my profile i'll explain uh, what all this will be my profile and uh, yeah these two these two uh, pages i am going to create this one so in the home page i am just printing uh, this in sender tag i am giving for better looking sender tag uh, and in h1 uh, home page okay now uh, in the index page as you can see uh, this is uh, just an uh, submit button and uh, a form here where we will uh, submit our username and password now I am going to give a message here actually down here in the Java tags I am giving a string message and I will show you how to get the message if the login is failed now in the sign in controller as you can see here login is login let, let uh, the login success be there I am first going to login failed here now in the login field i am uh, setting this message in a session actually so how it will be like session dot uh, set attribute so we should give a name for the message so i am giving a name for the message as uh, login message and we should type the content of the message okay so i am typing the content of the message as uh, uh, something like a login failed the username and uh, password is uh, wrong okay yes now we have uh, given the uh, message here now we should uh, take back the screen uh, back to uh, our login screen let me delete this one so to uh, get back to the login screen i mean the index page we should uh, use uh, i'm using the help of javascript so i am uh, ending this java tags here and opening it again and inside that i am going to write a javascript tag to uh, take me back to the index page so it will be like script text or javascript so inside this okay now adding the window dot location dot href and inside this uh, just uh, get uh, the link of your index page i just copied the now it should take you back uh, to the login uh, page and uh, now I'm going to write uh, to receive the message here we have to get that uh, session there okay so in the message here I'm uh, just getting that uh, uh, session here so session dot get attribute and uh, give the name which we have uh, given there so in the sign in controller it's like login message so same we should receive here okay so this session is of object type we should type cost back to string actually so it will be like string okay now we should uh, print the message if a uh, message is not uh, nothing is there in, uh, i mean message is not null so should like should like if uh, message not equal to null just uh, print not string it will be message not equal to null just print the message like out dot print the line, uh, message here okay yes now once the message is printed we don't need that session so we can uh, remove the session like session dot uh, remove attribute uh, login message okay I'll show you the problem what if uh, uh, this uh, this line of code is not there first okay now let me uh yeah go back to your login screen let me refresh this one yes i'm just entering a wrong value here if i'm just uh, writing anything and if, if i'm submitting again it should take me back with that message which we have given now we can see here that uh, message is added to the session now if i'm just keeping on at this uh refreshing this page that a message remains there okay so if i'm just remove this session i mean uh this comment comment line i mean uh, i have just uh enabling this uh, line of code and if i'm just refreshing that 
and again the next time the message should be gone okay so if i'm just submitting it it will be coming and if i'm in the next time if i'm visiting the message will be gone so we have said uh, to get back to the uh, login screen here now we can go to the home page here okay okay now in the sign in controller uh, if the login is success i am just uh, going inside of uh, we should go to the home page so let me copy paste uh, the same code here from here copy it from here and paste it here okay so if the flag is uh, true it should go to the home page so home page is located like uh, login project uh, inside the profile uh, and inside the view Uh, inside the view uh, sorry it's like view inside the view and uh, the home dot jsp okay it's like home dot jsp correct yes home dot jsp so uh, the flag is uh, true it should go to this link okay now let's try it uh, yes let's try it i'm just refreshing again our project now uh, our username is uh, jinu1234 and password is 1234.56 so it's like jinu1234 and the password is 1234.56 okay if i'm just clicking at the you can see here it is uh, taking to the home.jsp what happened we have uh, given something there in the home page no no yes yes uh, we have ended this in, in wrong page should be in home page okay i'm just saving it now going back and refreshing it yes this is home page so we have successfully uh, came into home page now quickly i'm going to create a small tab here to navigate between uh, the pages here okay so uh, going to the home page again let me create a tab here so it will be like a table okay i'm making it simple uh, in table I'm just giving it as uh, in a, give a row here tr so inside this I'm going to give a column here td and I'm just writing directly it as home and the profile okay home and profile now if I'm going to here and refreshing it okay just give the table as border give a table border to, to the table so it will be uh, easy for understanding okay yeah home and profile okay now I have added a small modification here I had made uh, this as an href uh, link so it will be take if uh, uh, it is home it will be taking the same page and if it is profile it is going to the my profile so in here I'm just uh, in the profile page I have given it as home page let it be profile page okay now I'm copying the same table which, uh, with the tab the navigation tab I'm just copying that same to the my profile page here okay so it will be coming in uh, those two pages now going back and uh, let me go back to our login let me refresh completely now i'm just putting it as chino1234 and the password is 1234.56 let me submit it yes it's going to the uh, profile page now uh, the home page now now if i'm clicking the profile page it is going to the profile and the heading is changed okay so we can navigate between uh, two pages so this is the basic navigation tab of uh, uh, inside uh, the uh, inside the after login okay so this is how uh, we generate the navigation tabs in JSPs now uh, if I'm copying this link directly to my another tab here this is the Mo uh, Mozilla Firefox here if I'm just pasting directly the home page it is coming there so there is no uh, login or uh, logout and even we, I, there is no login at all so if I'm copying the link of the home page to the Mozilla Firefox is coming there so how to block this you should not uh, go to the home page if uh, it is not logged in even if we are copying the uh, link there it should go back to the uh, login screen I mean the login uh, 
screen there so you should ask the user to sign in first okay so how to do that i'll show you how